Hello friends and welcome to the channel. This is Stormhaven Gaming, I'm John, and this is Foundation. I have played on for about two weeks, just over two weeks I think. Um, from the end of last episode, our bakery is in and producing bread. Uh, our stone church down here is still waiting for polished stone and is going to be for some time. Um, we have a new fisher's hut down here. Whoops. Uh, a new fisher's hut down here. Um, so we're fishing the heck out of this bit of water here. Uh, we have five fisher's huts now. Over here, we are slowly making our way through this woodland. Uh, we do have enough space here to put in a dairy farm uh, if we want to unlock one, which not a bad idea. Um, as you see, our, our stock of bread is increasing. That was good. That that was very, very low before the, the bakery went in, so that's that's nice. Stock of fish is increasing slowly now that this is in. That's literally only just gone in, so uh, give that a moment to, uh, to bed in properly. Um, just having a look, see if there's any other food that we can set up gatherers or anything on. If there's any berry bushes or anything that I've missed, but I don't think there is. No. Okay, then. Uh, up here, our little iron production area is working. Uh, slowly, but it is working. Uh, we're up to, what are we on? 57 tools, so that's good. We won't need to spend money buying those in anymore. Uh, unless we, you know, use them all. Uh, we have a fair stock of ore. Um, tiny bit of... Um, iron in form of ingots um, but that should be changing if if this is working which it appears to be okay so what are we going to do I do want to expand um, oops I want to expand this way because just off in the haze there there are resources so moving closer to those would be a good idea um, also want to expand this sort of housing area over here, uh, put in a market maybe. Um, yeah, other than that, there's not a lot urgently on the, uh, on the horizon. Um, I do also eventually want to, if we have a look at our progression tree, I do want to unlock the military fort and build that. Because that will give us some splendour um, for the Kingdom estate. Maybe we'll look at that this episode. Uh, but the first thing I'm going to do... What is the first thing I'm going to do? The first thing I'm going to do is unlock dairy farming. I have decided. Am I going to unlock... Or do I unlock beer? Ooh. I didn't see that before. Sturdy material edict. Upkeep of production building parts are decreased by 50%. Refund 50% of the tools used after constructing a building part. Ooh. Mmm, both of those are quite good, actually. What have we got here? Uh, oh, yes, that was the, um, the weird one that decreases our food production. Okay, no, I'm going to unlock dairy farming. I have unlocked dairy farming. Okay, so a dairy farm. Let's pop a dairy farm in here. Um, and I'm wondering if I should put a fence around here to stop people from walking across the field to get to it. Hopefully we'll be all right. Oops. Uh, we won't bother with the cheese maker just yet, but what we will put in is a granary. Now, where can we squeeze a granary? And let's put it in there. And we will just get rid of that. Oops, get rid of that. A little bit of residential around the warehouse so nobody builds there. Okay, that's going on. Right, we have 220 coins left. Our 
monastery is doing well. We do have enough to promote another nun or monk. Which would increase our intake of honey. Okay, yes, let's do that. Let's promote... Um, where are we? Promote to brother, promote to prior we can't. Prioress we can't. Okay, uh, do we want a nun or do we want a monk? Um, I think we have one of each at the moment. Um, let's up the herbalist. Yes? Yes. There we go. Um, and shall we promote a couple more of our serfs? Why not? There we go. That'll do. Okay, now we will um, devote a female visitor. Uh, oh, should have done a male. Never mind. We'll, we'll bung another male in as well. So, that should be full. Um, we have 17, so... There is one job available. Okay, well, in which case... Um, let's pop in another herb planter just there. Okay. There we go. Right. I will now spin on uh, until some of this building work is complete and hopefully we'll have enough uh, villagers to, to staff the whole thing. Oh, we got new ones coming in, so that's good. Right, we appear to have a slight problem here. They've built their house very, very close to this uh, granary, and we're having problems reaching it. So, I'm going to delete this house. And let's just make sure they don't build back there again. Uh, and we'll actually get rid of a bit more around the church as well. Just make sure there's plenty of space. Okay. Hopefully that will sort the problem out. It will upset them a little bit because I've just, you know, torn their house down. But never mind. Okay. Um, over here, the granary is in. And I've got it, for the moment, storing milk, cheese, uh, fish and wheat. Uh, the dairy farm is nearly complete. Uh, but we don't have any uh, villagers at the moment. And I may have just discouraged some from coming in, but we'll see about that. Uh, let's have a look. Oh no, there's a couple coming in over there. That's fine then. Okay, everything else seems to be working fine. Our little um, planter is built. The dairy farm is now complete. So we just need to wait until uh, until people turn up. Okay, I am going to buy that territory. I'm going to expand our residential space across here. Oh, we have a courier on their way in. That's opened up access to those mineral deposits up there. So, we need to probably wait until we've got some money now. Yeah. Okay, well, we'll we'll do that. We'll wait until uh, we've got a little bit of money coming in. I may need to up the taxes. Um, hmm. Should I just up the taxes? What are our taxes set at at the moment? Yeah, moderate. All right, we'll push them up a little bit, just briefly. Let's see if that helps. Uh, we have two newcomers coming in, so we'll put one of them into the uh, uh, dairy farm. We'll spawn, I think, five cows. I think that was five cows. 
And if we speed up a little bit and get these villagers in. Well, I think we only need one in there, don't we? Yes. So one in there, one in the granary. That should be fine. There's the courier. You can wait. Come on, villagers. Get a move on. There we go. Right. Both of you in. One of you. Come and work in the dairy farm. One of you come and work in the granary. Uh, and then we're going to need to build a cheese maker. That's the wrong button. That's the one I want. Uh, cheese maker. 200 gold upfront cost. So we'll need to wait for that as well. Okay. Courier, what do you want? Hosting wandering monks. A fellowship of wandering monks would like to spend a month at your hospitium. Well, they don't have much to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, what have we got? We need 50 berries. We could probably do that. There we go. So that will help. And then they're going to come in for a, a month. Okay, well, our, our coins are increasing slowly. So we will spin on. Uh, I'll wait till we get the money in. And then we'll put in a cheese maker somewhere. Possibly over here. That might be a good place for it. Or possibly out in the trees somewhere. I don't know. We'll, we'll have a look. Okay. So we have um, a merchant approach, I think it was. Um, sorry. What do you want? Um, they would like us to host a regional fair. This is an occasion to open up more trading opportunities by celebrating the fruit of hard labour. Make sure the mood at the fair stays high. Your people will do the rest. Okay. Raise the happiness of your village to 50. It's already at 70. Uh, wait for the fair to be over. Let's have a fair. So, 20 days. We need to basically just maintain our happiness over 50%. That should be fine. He says, watch our happiness now fall through the floor. Um, okay, so what is occurring? Over here, uh, I am putting in another windmill uh, because we're running lower on flour not low but lower uh, and our wheat is building up a little bit uh, so I'm just putting in another windmill to, to to sort of cycle through that uh, in addition some of our fields are not being fully harvested so there is wheat going spare uh, so if we can you know make sure there's there's space in our storage for the wheat that's getting produced that would be a bit more efficient. Um, over here, I am putting in a cheese maker. Blessed are the cheese makers. Uh, we're waiting for polished stone. That is our choke hold at the moment. Um, or choke point, rather, at the moment. Uh, we do have three uh, stone masons producing polished stone. Um, but obviously, a lot of it is going over to our church over here. Uh, we still need another, what, 30 odd um, polished stone. But we have newcomers in again, which is nice. Um, our wandering monks are mostly happy. We've got, we couldn't fulfill a need. What need can we not fulfill? Service, by the looks of it. Hmm. I wonder if we need to expand our uh, chapel somewhat. That would involve buying more land. Um, not just at the moment. They'll they can cope with it for the moment. I think they're still over um, eighty percent approval, so that's okay. And they should be able to if they can, you know, squeeze themselves into one of the places of worship. They should be able to fulfil that. I'll keep an eye on it, but there's not a lot we can do. We're not going to be able to get anything built in time to, to sort that out. So, that is that is what it is. Um, over here, our dairy farm is producing milk. Um, if we look up here, we already have 108 milk. Which is lovely. 
Um, our windmill is built, so we can put a couple of workers in there. Yeah, okay. Okay. Um, our... Where are we? There we are. Our bailiff is busy prospecting away. As for this trading thing we're doing, uh, trading with Davenport, I think it is. Where are we? Trading with Davenport. A uh, thousand golds worth of resources. Now, Davenport buys uh, fish, clothes, honey, uh, candles, barrels, and wax. Let's have a look. We are not yet selling honey. Let's start selling honey. Everything over 50 for honey. Uh, wax we'll want to keep hold of because sooner or later I'll want to actually build... I don't know if I can yet. I cannot. Um, what do I need to unlock for that? Common goods. So eventually I'll want to unlock that and start making candles. Um... And obviously we'll be able to make uh, common wares as well, if we ever build up a halfway decent supply of iron. Which we're not. It's all going into making tools. Um, obviously that would be helped by buying one of these plots of land, whichever one it is. I might actually need both, just to get uh, another mine on this. Uh, iron node. Um, let's have a look. Where would it go? Do you know what? I think that is right on the corner, isn't it? Yeah, that's right on the corner. Huh. I might actually need to buy both of those plots of land just to access that. Well, that's unfortunate. Our bailiff's only found stone. Which is even less fortunate. Um, we have some newcomers. Hello, hello. Um, what's, what's all this? Who are you? You're visiting. Oh, I assume you're here for the um, market fair thing, are you? Good, good. Enjoy yourself. Have fun. Hmm. Right, well, I'm going to need to send the um, bailiff out again. So, let's do that. Oh, delighted visitors. Which, which ones are you? Uh, some, of the visit, uh, some of the visitors had a great time and cheered up your villagers. Happiness bonus of 15% for villagers with citizen, commoner and serf status. Nice. Not sure which one that is. Possibly that one. Even though it's not finished yet. Who knows? Who knows? But it's nice anyway. Right, what's happening with our... Not a lot. Still waiting for five more polished stone. Okay, well, we'll we'll rush on. Uh, I'll come back in uh, probably seven days. Come back in a week when the uh, regional fair finishes. Um, that looks like that's going to be okay. There's three days left on that. That should be fine. Okay, the Merry Fair was a success. The fair lived up to expectations. People from all around are spreading good words about your fine craftsmanship and hope to do further business with your village. Trade price bonus of 10% from Village with Labour Allegiance. No idea which one that is. We'll have a look. Happiness bonus of 25% for villagers with citizen, commoner and serf status. So as you can see, our happiness is currently up at 111%. Which is quite nice. So, let's spin on. Um, we are still waiting for this to be uh, constructed. Uh, our church over here is eating up all of our polished stone, even though this is on priority and that one isn't. Never mind. 
Okay. So that's where we are at the moment. Um, uh, the monks left happy as well. Uh, I should point out. Um, well, I think we managed to maintain about 90% happiness for them. So that's okay. Um, yeah, we, we've maxed out our milk storage for the moment. Waiting for this cheese maker to hurry up. So I'm just going to have to spin on until that's done, I think. Um, nobody has yet chosen to move in over here. Which is fair. I haven't put in a market or anything over here yet. Um, I should probably do that, shouldn't I? Let's let's do that. Let's put a market in up here. Um, there we go. So... Uh, we want a market store. Right. Food stalls. I'll have one there. And one there. And for the moment, we'll just have uh, a good stall opposite. We will give them signs. Thank you, autosave. And we'll stick a bench in either side there. Okay, get that built. That shouldn't take very long at all. We have the builders and the resources to just throw that together in no time. Um, oh, we're, 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 we're nearly at 10 polished stone. Wow. Okay, so I will spin on until these are done and then I'll be right back. Okay, spun on a little bit more. Uh, nearly finished with the cheese maker. The market is built, uh, and we well, all bar the the, the stalls, but the the um, market stalls themselves are in and, and selling. Uh, we are very very low on common clothes, so I'm also putting in uh, another tailor's workshop over here, and we might need to look at um, another weaver's as well depending on how quickly that goes through. And we have a merchant up here, so uh, what do you want? The bishop is looking to purchase large shipments of wheat. Um, and you're going to give me 100 gold for them? Uh, no. Let's just do that. Go for it. There we go. I think we're harvesting at the moment anyway, so that will actually free up some space in our granaries. Yeah. That's good. Okay, right. Uh, and in addition, our stone church is built. Isn't that nice? And no one's complaining that they can't get into their house, which is which is a bonus. So that's all done. Uh, the tailor's workshop is built. So we'll put a tailor to work. And our cheesemaker is up. Hooray! Okay, so we've only got one worker that we can put in there. Uh, looks like we've got another one coming in just here. So they'll be uh, put to work as soon as they get here. Now, I am concerned about the clothing situation. So I'm going to spin on for a little bit longer and I'll see how our resources do. I'm hoping that that will climb, that will drop a little bit, but everything else will, will maintain at a decent level. If we start getting through this too quickly, then I'm going to need to put in another weaver's hut. Um, we do only have one at the moment, so yeah, I might need another weaver's hut. But we'll have a look at that. Um, oh, the markets are built, good. And I'm going to unlock the military fort, am I? Or do I want to unlock that first? I want to unlock that first, don't I? Yes, I'm going to do that. Uh, candle workshop, right. And what do I need to build a candle workshop? Do I have everything? Yes, it's polished stone, but... We're not using that anywhere else at the moment. Um, 
Right, everything's being produced up here, so... Let's have a look. Where's the entrance? There's the entrance. Um, let's put it... There. 300 gold to build. Okay. Uh, newcomer. Hello, come in. You need to go and work in the cheese maker. There we go. Right. I'm going to need to let our money build up again. Uh, we still have... Um, a very high happiness rating, so I could increase the taxes. No, I'll leave them where they are at the moment. I think. Yeah, just so we've built up a, a, a buffer again, I think. I'll leave it there. Right. Okay, yeah, I will spin on until our um, candle maker is complete. Oh, I want to check something first, though. Whoops. Okay, well, I won't be able to do it now, anyway. Um, Because I know you used to be able to build an upgrade for that, but do we have to buy an upgrade for that now? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that, that's a late-stage upgrade to be able to do that. Right, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, we will spin on. Okay, span on for just about a day, if that. And our bailiff only found stone again. This isn't looking good. This is not looking good at all. We'll start with the last one. Right, here we are a, a little while longer. We have another courier, so uh, what do you want? A favour for the abbess. Okay, they want the delegates to turn up again. Okay, sure. Fine. Right, uh, more newcomers. In you come. Uh, candle workshop still isn't done. We're waiting for uh, well, one more polished stone after the one that's being bought now. Um, over here, as you can see, we are getting some housing built up around here now, which is nice. Uh, people have decided to move over to this area. Um, our well is there. That's okay. It's not exactly central, but it's fine. I think. Uh, Clothes-wise, we are slowly building up a, a bit more of a stock. But it is slow. Um... Our stock of cloth and wool isn't really decreasing. So it looks like we are sort of keeping balanced at the moment, but I will continue to keep an eye on that. Um, we now have all the resources for this, and we have a builder on it on their way over. So that's good. Uh, with our trading for the mystery tax, we have now increased to 279 out of 1,000 gold. So that is increasing as well. So, I mean, it's increasing slowly, but it is increasing. Uh, so obviously putting the, I think the honey up for sale was the, the right um, right choice there. We've got some newcomers coming in. Right, we need work for some of these. We've got the uh, candle workshop going in. That'll be fine. So we are going to need somewhere to store candles. So we are going to need probably another warehouse somewhere. I'm just looking to see if we've got any warehouses with spare space, but um, that's a granary. I'm having difficulty actually seeing warehouses at the moment. I can see the three we've got there. Is that all of them? Um, yeah, okay. Oh, there's one there. Ah, and you can store wax and candles already. Okay, that's fine, then. Okay, right. I will spin on a bit more, I think. Um, we should have no problem with this. That that This one should be fine, this, this negotiations. We're good at those. Do I want to spin on... Mm.
Okay. I'm going to buy... this territory. I'm going to try and put on another quarry. No, nope, that's outside of the territory still. So I do need that other one as well. What do you mean iron deposit changes complete? I didn't do anything. Right. Okay, well in which case... I'm going to unlock the military fort. Let's see what we've got. I'm going to put it up here. Uh, select a function. Okay. So let's start with the barracks. I think. Uh, and we'll put the barracks... Just down here a little bit. My idea is we're going to have the actual keep up here on this uh, raised area. There we go. We'll put some stairs on like that. Um, can we make that a little bigger? That's a bit silly. That That's all right. That's okay. Um, does it need an interactive um, location? No, it doesn't. Okay, build that. That'll be our barracks. Presumably at some point we might get a, a, a mission pop up to tell us about building a keep, but it hasn't popped up yet, so... I will spin on until... Um, until the barracks are built. I'll, I'll give them a chance to build those, unless something happens in the meantime. Okay, well, a courier's just arrived, so what do you want? A noble day. The king has noticed your military fort, and wants to be sure that you, his loyal vassal, have everything you need to host an army. Once armed and trained, the king expects your soldiers to contribute to the peace of the realm. I am at your service, my liege. Okay. Weapons received. The king expects you to answer his call and protect the realm. So, we've got some swords in. That's nice. Uh, presumably that means that as soon as the barracks is built and we have some soldiers, they'll start offering us military missions to do. Uh, but it hasn't actually give us, uh, given us anything here. Okay, um, that has literally been a few minutes. So, our candle workshop is still waiting to be constructed. So, I will spin on. Okay, well, I've come back again earlier than expected. Uh, things are happening. Uh, first of all, we have a courier up here, so what do you want? There's plenty of fish in storage. Mm. And the elders believe your village is due for a fish fair. If you can make sure everyone has a splashing good time, there's a good chance the trading value of this resource will improve. Okay. So let's host the fish fair. Uh, trade bonus of 10%. Trade bonus of 25% for fish. Uh, okay, so that's good. Order my fishermen to work double. So we've got 50-50 chance of increasing or decreasing the fish yields. Um, influenced by our best fishermen level 4. Let's let's just host one, shall we? So that's, that's the first thing. Secondly, as you'll see, iron deposit changes are complete. And that is because... I bought this other plot of land and have expanded our iron mine. So I can put two workers in there. Um, looks like they're just building the stairs there now. Uh, I've also added in uh, some training dummies along here. Uh, so I've added a training ground to the um, barracks so we can actually train and heal our soldiers. And in further good news, our candle workshop is built. Uh, but additionally, we found an iron deposit up here. So the pressure is off a little bit for iron. Not entirely, but a little bit. So where's our candle workshop? Here we go. 
Uh, what do we need? Oh, we need commoners for that. All right, okay, well, that's not a problem because... What are you doing? Go away. Manor house. Mandate. Promote villagers. Right, let's... Let's be cheeky and just... Put a couple of... Um, unemployed serfs in. And then we can put them straight into the uh, candle workshop. Um, and we can probably increase this a little bit. Oh, our happiness is quite low, I've just noticed. So, let's jump back to our taxes and drop those a little bit. Yes, that, that's probably a good idea. What's affecting their happiness? Taxes. Yeah, makes sense. Okay. Right. We have a merchant on their way in as well, by the looks of it. Let's speed them up so they can get to the... Uh, uh, to the Great Hall. Come on. And then we can ask you, what do you want? Wood for the elders. Uh, so 100 for 100. 34% uh, chance to increase. Let's give it a go. Negotiation succeeded. We get 200. Yeah, brilliant. We'll do that then. Excellent. That's given us a bit of cash. Which was nice. Okay then. I think we'll leave it there for this episode. We've done all right. Uh, we've got some more iron, uh, or at least we have another iron deposit available to us. We've expanded our iron mining here. Uh, our whoop, our stone church is complete. Our bread situation has improved. Um, our clothing situation is still kind of touch and go. We've put in cheese farming. Cheese farming, dairy farming and cheese making. Um, we've expanded our territory Modestly, three new tiles. We have more fish coming in. Yeah. Yeah, I think we've done all right. That, that's not been bad. So we will leave it there for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Um, please do give us a like and su uh, subscribe if you've enjoyed it and you'd like to see more. Please check out the other videos on my channel. Give us comments down below. Let me know what you think. And until next time, I've been John. This has been Foundation. Please do take care of yourselves, stay safe, and bye-bye.